Parkinson's disease. My story is not unusual, but I think it's worth telling. The neurologist turns to me and goes, Ed, you've got Parkinson's disease. I said, what? He says, yeah, you're in the early stages of Parkinson's disease. I felt like I had just been struck by lightning and my life was over. What was I doing there? And I went into a very deep depression. And one day I got invited to come here to Scripps and one of the presentations was on Parkinson's disease. And for the first time in about a year, I saw a glimmer of hope. So I came up and volunteered to help with the personal gifts and to help raise money because I am convinced that the research that is being done here under the direction of Dr. Las Mesas will result in a cure. There's no question in my mind, having read the research, studied it time and time again, I have no doubt that within five to 10 years, they will find a cure. So a disease like Parkinson's doesn't get the kind of uh, attention and funding that it really deserves. So what we have to do is we have to continue to press the government to fund, but we also have to go to private philanthropy because without private philanthropy, it's going to be just too long a wait. Scripps is here and they're here for good. And for good, I mean in two ways, enduring and what they do to help uh, find cures for just horrible diseases. Thank you.